Hello, my name is Harry. Uh, we're here at Project Mamalito and we've just been spending time with the kids throughout the week and this is our last day here. Um, throughout the week we've gone to a church service um, which is all the way in Tegucigalpa which is the capital about an hour away and on other stuff we can do for the week we've, um, we've gone to the, the Valley of the Angels bought some weapons <laughs> uh, um, and uh, we, we've mainly just made the kids feel like someone loves them and that's what and a lot of the kids the word dad or the word dad or father is like an evil word to them because their dad either beats them or or beats their mum or threw them out in one way. Um, yeah, so they don't they don't really have a dad. So we've been there not not to be their dad, obviously, but like just to play with them and feel like they do actually have a family and someone like like actually likes them. And have you made some good friends here while you've been here? Yeah, I've made a great friend actually. I'm going to be really sad tomorrow when I go. He's just over there, his name's Owen. Um, made, made a really good friend. We, uh, yesterday we spent time just firing rocks at the barrel here with this um, and playing football and and the, fing the finger game and Game, games which I wouldn't usually play at home but it makes him so happy so he's he's older than me as well which is kind of weird he's a lot smaller uh, he's older and um, yeah he's a really good friend and and I hope to see him I'm, I, I think I will come back I will definitely will come back and I hope to see him in the near future and how is how are the children here different from those that you saw on the rubbish dump or on the streets. Um, Just well, give an idea for those young people, people that might be listening, what that's like. Uh, well, uh, I think that the kids here have been changed. They they still have an element of the part that passed behind in them, but the kids on the dump have nothing. They they. Uh, they do have, some of them do go to Afe, but when they come to Afe they're as dirty as, that they're really dirty in there. And they uh, work uh, eight till six. Yeah, all day, every day, trying to find plastic bottles so they can make money. And their dream, as high as they can think of, is to become a truck driver of the dump. People that have come in here some of the, three of them have become teachers. Uh, to, uh, I think a lot of them are doing well at school as well. And what would you say to people uh, watching or listening who might want to get involved in some way, give some money? What would your advice be? Um, I would uh, talk to, get in contact with either Ben, Ben Dale at St Peter's Church Youth or Matt Levitt, maybe, in uh, Suffolk. I'm not quite sure where he lives, but... Um, and uh, the Street Kids website. You could always... Because they have organised events every year. I think one's on the first Saturday of June. I, I'm not sure what quite the event is, but you can always get involved in that way. And it will be in Amersham, um, which is not too far away from where I live. Um, and things if you do get involved it can bring you onto great things like this and this has probably been the best experience of my life so far and I do hope to come back. <laughs>